Okay, RM, my movie room, gaming area is in my movie room. My music of what's been arriving fall over in, I guess into spring. We're in winter right now, so this is a new update. I need to try to get Pitfall 2. That's going to be my spring into summer, hopefully. I'm getting one more Pearl Jam on the way and into the end of the year I'll try to get back into my music. When I get caught up with my uh, TV shows, MASH came in. I got the uh, tall one, about $200 value. Voyager came in, almost $300 on that one. I'll give you the estimate price, 200 bucks plus 50 bucks on shipping. So about 250 bucks. That's how I do things for you guys. Because shipping is quite high sometimes. Uh, completed Star Trek, the original. That's starting up the original. That's uh, Enterprise or the silver set. The original is over here on this side. I get mixed up with them. I can't call that one the original, but the original is on this side, so yellow, blue, and red. And I need to uh, get a couple more TV shows over the winter and then see how things go for this spring, summer. Hopefully I get a couple more games, though I am picking up some repros, which is fine as well. Some of them can be costing 300 bucks, 400 bucks. So... That's how things are looking. I'm not doing any toys yet. Probably in one year I'll try to get some toys and after that, unless I find them thrifting. I'll keep an eye out for Sega system. So that's on my list in one year or so. I need to build up on some Sega. And I need to get some ROM adapter joysticks as well. So those will be coming in the spring and summer, hopefully. And I need to replace season 12 and for Supernatural, try to get some deluxe box sets for Dukes of Hazards. If I see them thrifting, I bought this slim pack. Give you a little quick look around how my room looks like on this side. All these shelves I made, so this wood was kind of wonky, so it doesn't look perfect, but the movies are not standing on the floor or on a desk, which is enough for me. Maybe in two years I could replace these ones, buy some better wood from wherever they sell wood, Home Depot or whatever. I don't know how much they sell a plank of wood like this for, but if it's like 10 bucks a sheet, if I need them cut down, not cut down that I cannot buy it. So if it's like wide enough for my VHS I could buy and cut it down at home but if they sell it in sheets then I cannot bring it home. So I think they sell it in sheets and bundles or something I don't know how the wood works or you have to buy 10 or 20 in a bundle or something I don't know. But Box sets, I still need Star Wars number three. I've got two Star Wars number one. One's widescreen. A very nice, I don't have the casing. What was that? So anyway, thanks for watching. Some strange noise. animal or something. You know, here's all my horror. I need quite a few more to go. Hopefully I'll have them this year. Invisible Man, Invisible Woman, Dracula's Bride and Dracula's Daughter, stuff like that. Creature of the Black Lagoon. Still need a Phantom of the Opera. So, Yeah, I do have Frankenstein's Bride, came in the uh, pack, 
$40 movie on its own. Most of them I'm going to have to buy separately, not in a pack. So I have some doubles here and there, like three Wolfman. And it's looking pretty good. Things are holding up. Maybe get some Disney toys along the way, thrifting or something. Picking things up here and there. Still keep my games in the other room. Still got a couple of games on the way. So I picked up the Disney hat not too long ago. Nothing great from thrifting, but I got Batman cars there. So that's the Star Trek. This complete set, but two of them off eBay. Generation. That's it. I keep forgetting that. First one I probably ever bought was Walking Dead and Doctor Who. I think Doctor Who was the first one because Netflix doesn't have Doctor Who in my area. So, and then I was working on Supernatural. Mash. I have this big bunky box. It. I should have got the other one, but it will have taken up more room, but this one looked pretty cool. It still looks cool. So, luckily it fit in this uh, case. So, I might do some shelving in a year or two down the line. But if I find some shelving in the garbage, I'll pick it up for sure, if I can. And every now and then I'll try to add some more music. Got one row, two rows, three rows, four rows of music, five rows, six rows, seven, almost eight rows, and then some random PC games and stuff like that are down there. My tapes are down below. My bags I take with me when I go thrifting or pop shopping. Hopefully, it gets Superman and Supergirl at some point and replace this toy. Get the actual figure, about 50 to 100 bucks. They're pretty expensive. And boost up some more Transformers. Right now, this is all the toys and dolls I have. So, how the room is. Thanks for watching. I'll pile up my chips on this till it gets filled up. Thanks for watching.